going to show you how to make a simple green drink. And the ingredients we're using today are watermelon. This is a sustainable watermelon. Sustainable basically means if I was growing it in my yard. It's not uh, certified organic, but it's been grown without any chemicals. So I feel comfortable with juicing the rind as well as the meat. Uh, also have some uh, sustainable cucumbers and uh, these key limes, which weren't sustain sustainable, but what I did was I peeled the uh, skin off of it to juice those. And I used key limes as opposed to other limes or lemons because they're the most natural, one of the more natural citrus fruits available. Okay. Now we get into the really powerful stuff. This is basically the stuff to make it such so that you can drink it down. <laughs> uh, we're making green drink. I don't know if I didn't mention that. This is amaranth. Can you see that? It's beautiful, isn't it? I also am juicing lamb's quarters. Very high in calcium. My nails are a testament to that. And last, but certainly not least, dandelions. Those beautiful leaves that uh, in people's yards they want to uh, kill with weed killer, but make sure you understand that this is a very powerful plant, powerful cleanser and nourisher. So, let's get started. This is my Omega Juicer. Very excited about it. It juices greens quite well. Starting with the dandelion greens. It sounds like it's actually eating the uh, leaves. It's a, um, an auger style juicer rather than the other. Uh, I have a champion as well, but the champion doesn't work very well with juicing greens. So that's why I ended up getting this juicer because it doesn't have that rapid action with the blades that heats up the plant food and actually cooks it. I don't want my, my greens cooked. So, um, let's push it down a little bit. We're getting a nice green extraction. I think I'll throw this in. This cucumber. Yeah, I might as well throw the other one in too green stuff out the way. Now, we'll start juicing the Z-Melon. Take those through very smoothly. And when you select your watermelon, make sure you get a real one. Later for this, this um, so-called convenient seedless stuff, Actually, are not as convenient as they appear to be because they're not possessing the nutrition you actually need. Real food has seeds, so get seeded fruits and vegetable fruits as well. Seeded fruits whenever possible. See, listen to how it sounds like it's chewing up 
It's literally chewing up the, um, the fruit. I like that. Okay, so I have a strainer in here. So I've got to uh, make sure everything goes down. Goes through the strainer. Or else I have a mess. <laughs> That's happened before. <laughs> with this. I can hardly wait. Get in there. Mm. Almost done. Okay, I'm really pleased with this product. This uh, Omega Juicer. I think it's series. Don't quote me on that. <laughs> Come on. Get those key lines in there. I think I'll put this in last. Well, I'll put the, put the key line in last, I should say. And there goes the last of the key line. Pour the rest of that juice in there. Run a little, a few more seconds, about a minute. Uh oh. Mm, we've got lots of juice. That's what's going on here. So, here's what we're going to do. Oh boy. How about abundanza? <laughs> mm, 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 mm. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, I'll tap that, try to get all that, as much essence out of there without getting all that pulp. Well, it's not much pulp, as you can see. That, that, that's about it. Okay, so stick that in there. And I will try my best to, you know what, I think I'm going to do this so I don't lose any of my essence. I'm going to put this here so that if I get a spill, which I probably will, Container. But at any rate, this is the finished product. Mm. You can taste the green, but then the watermelon sweetness is not too sweet. It rounds it out. It's a very refreshing morning drink. Salute.